the fifth unit in measurement instruments instruments is classified as indicating recording and integrating indicating instruments just indicate the reading recording instruments just record the reading integrating instruments indicate as well as record for example indicating instruments means our voltmeter ammeter all the indicating instruments recording instruments ecg eeg or recording instruments integrating means our energy meter indicate the value as well as record the value for every month we will get the leading from the uh, energy meter now that is our integrating instruments okay these are the examples of our indicating recording and uh, integrating instruments so next uh, this indicating instruments is classified as two types one is pmmi instruments and another one is pmmc instruments pmmi means permanent magnet moving coil sorry pmmi permanent magnet moving iron pmmc permanent magnet moving coil i'll explain first you will see the pmmc instrument the listen here pmmc instrument so pmmc the operating principle of this instruments is same of our motor principle that is a current carrying conductor plays in magnetic field it exert a force the same principles is used in pmmc instrument and uh, tell letter pmmc permanent magnet moving coil from this we get a magnet is permanent coil will be moving there is one permanent magnet and one moving coil is present in this instrument that so is it is called as pmmc permanent magnet moving coil instruments now listen permanent magnet means magnet is permanent coil will be moving permanent magnet produce a magnetic field there is n s there is a constant there is no change in the magnetic field then this coil the coil um uh, is rectangular shape or it's in the circular shape that is rectangular means the coil uh, coil is wound in the core no that core is spherical in shape coil is in rectangular shape coil is in circular core is in cylindrical coil is in rectangular adavad enna solranga na inda edathla inda coil irukku liya coil vande rectangular shape la irukum enna shape la irukum circular shape la irukum so coil vande rectangular ah irundaduna inda coil edhula wound pannirukkaangala inda core enna va irukum spherical ah irukano coil vande rectangular ah irukumbodhu sphere irukum cylindrical ah irukano appadina solranga okay now next core core is made up of iron hence deflection torque increases as well as sensitivity increases deflection torque i will tell later the deflecting torque is indicated as a t suffix d t is torque d is deflection so deflecting torque next s is the sensitivity okay now so this is our pmmc permanent magnet moving coil instrument the principle is motoring principle when a current carrying conductor placed in a magnetic field produced by a permanent magnet the coil experience a force and hence move so this principle is nothing but our motor principle next one construction construction means we know that two permanent magnet n yes next one that is the coil center is there no this is a coil okay the coil next the coil is on aluminum farmer of uh, aluminum farmer coil is wound on the aluminum farmer okay next the coil is connected in a spindle very clear is connected in the spindle the spindle is placed in the pivot jewel bearing pivot jewel bearing why we are using this pivot pivoted shape actually the shape is like that no pivoted shape means this produce no friction to the spindle so spindle nagum easy a move pananona you know, enna pandrom adanalai nam enna vela the pivot shape la vechirukom appo enna agudhu friction illama the spindle move agum the spindle move ana nagum automatically the pointer is connected in the spindle no the pointer also moved okay the pointer is moved in a graduated scale the scale is that is 0 1 2 3 4 5 the scale is uniform 
அதாவது ஸ்கேலில் வந்து ஜீரோ ஒன் டூ த்ரீ ஃபோர் அந்த மாதிரி தான் இருக்கும் ஜீரோ டென் டுவெண்ட்டி ஃபிஃப்டீன்ஸ் அந்த மாதிரி ஸ்கேல்ஸ் இருக்காது இட் இஸ் அ யூனிஃபார்ம் ஸ்கேல் நவ் த பாயிண்டர் இஸ் மூவ் இன் த யூனிஃபார்ம் ஸ்கேல் பிலோ த ஸ்கேல் எ மிரர் இஸ் ப்ரெசன்ட் வை திஸ் மிரர் இஸ் ப்ரெசன்ட் மீன்ஸ் டு அவாய்ட் த பேரலாக்ஸ் எரர் தட் இஸ் ஹவு வி மெஷர்ட் மீன்ஸ் அ ஸ்பாயிண்டர் நீடில் and the image of the pointer in the mirror both are coincide that time we take a reading so we avoid the parallax error that is if a pointer is clear the pointer scale will move agudhu scale enna irukku or mirror irukum if a pointer and the mirror coincide ana edc la padichirpinga pointer and mirror coincide agudhu illaya adha mirror oda image and the time la enna varudho adha nammoda reading, reading a irukum okay then next type the pointer the extent of the pointer is connected to a balancing weight for perfect balance next one spring is present in this spindle why we are using the spring means the spring produce a controlling torque what is controlling torque actually we have a th- you need three type of torque what is the torque first one is the deflection torque deflection torque is used to deflect the spindle from zero position to whatever may be the corresponding position okay that is produced by one torque that's called, called as deflection torque next one is controlling torque so beyond this the mood uh, needle not go to the beyond the level to controlling purpose we are using the controlling torque then oscillations is present no to avoid the oscillation we are using the damping torque so three torques one is controlling torque another one is one is deflection torque controlling torque damping torque now explain so ipo parunga deflection abdinum bodu enna pandran for example now supply is given okay now what happen this coil get magnetized now it have a normally a current carrying conductor is placed in the magnetic field what happen it exert a force now now the coil exert a force the spindle is connected to the coil okay there is no friction in the spindle because of this pivot shaped resting arrangement now what happen coil will move automatically spindle will move spindle will move means our pointer will move on the scale now we get a reading okay so for this pointer movement is depend on our input okay suppose my input is 5 ampere means automatically the pointer shows the 5 amp in a scale so beyond that level the pointer didn't go and the 5 amps can avad mele pogadu that is controlled by our controlling force that controlling force is produced by our spring okay ipo nach deflection torque na enna therinju pochu deflect to the 5 amps then it not go to beyond the 5 amps that is produced by our produced by controlling torque that is by controlling torque that controlling torque is produced by our spring are you clear okay then final one is damping torque the damping torque is used to avoid the oscillations suppose our spindle is shown a 5 ampere sorry not spindle our pointer is show a 5 ampere are you clear now that not go beyond the level by means of spring tension at the same time the pointer will be oscillate in the 5 ampere that is called as damping the damping is controlled by a damping arrangement okay so controlling torque deflection torque controlling torque damping torque deflection is directly proportional to our input then controlling is directly proportional to the spring tension damping is directly depend upon our balancing weight balancing are you clear okay now input is given it is a permanent magnet now this is your spind uh, pointer this is a uniform scale this is your moving coil arrangement this is your magnetic shape now listen this magnet the permanent magnet no that's in harsh shoe shape harsh shoe very clear so this is the shape okay then supply is given this coil get magnetized and you experience a force that force produce a damping now our pointer will move from 0 to that particular ampere or particular reading okay beyond that level it doesn't go because of this spring tension next one to avoid the oscillation we are using this balancing weight anyway to this coil spring and weight are produce the deflection controlling and 
damping torque this is a working principle working principle nothing is working principle input is given coil get magnetized the producer deflect this pointer pointer is depend upon the input that's all okay here controlling is produced by a spring tension then damping is produced by a balancing weight this is a this is a construction this is a principle of operation okay right now derivation of torque equation so this torque equation td is equal to td is equal to n b a i what is d deflection torque what is n number of turns in the coil what is a effective coil area current i is current flow through the coil then b is the flux density g is equal to n b a this n b a no that is indicated as a g so constant so td is equal to g into i gravity now tc this is your deflection torque this is your controlling torque that controlling torque is directly proportional to our angle theta right now this tc is equal to ks into theta what is ks spring tension that spring only produce a controlling torque no so this ks is a spring constant then theta is angular deflection at equilibrium condition our controlling torque is equal to damping torque that is tc is equal to td so tc is equal to ks into theta td is equal to g into i from this we find out the theta value that is our angular deflection is directly proportional to our current suppose a current uh, current is particular 5 ampere it produces a corresponding angular deflection as the direction of the current through the coil changes the direction of the deflection of the point also changes hence pm mc instruments are well suited for dc instrument that is the important two mark question why PMMC instruments we should it for DC measurements okay these are the errors then advantage of the PMMC instrument okay thank you